Cal Penn's campus seems to be clinging on to the underdog momentum. We got some dogs on the court, all right? We uh -huh. got dogs. That's what Penn, that's what Penn produces. Hey, we got Philly grit and we're coming out. We're ready to take on Kansas. They may be number one right now. They're not number one for long. Bill Self, the Kansas coach, he talked about how when our coaches at Cornell, it gave them a tough time. I think this team is better than his Cornell team. It's funny because I'm a Patriots fan. I'm from Massachusetts. Yeah. So it proves that the underdogs can win. Yes. You know, I was liking you up until now. <laughs> no, <I'm sorry. laughs> Over in Nova Nation, this campus couldn't feel more confident. Our team is playing as a team like the best we played together in a while. Jalen Brunson's the best player in the country by far. I just think that. Uh, we played well during the Big East tournament. We're all excited. I think this is just another year for the Cats. But take it from these seniors, there's only one way to tackle this tournament. One game at a time. Enjoy the ride. Cross your fingers. Go Cats. Go Cats, go Quakers. That's two awesome teams in one great city. And just like that senior said, we just have to take it one day at a time. It's going to be a very exciting start to March Madness, you guys. Indeed it yes, will. Yes, and they are clearly very excited, which they should be, Tori. <laughs> Thank you. Thanks, Tori. CBS 3 is following March Madness from the first round of the Final Four. The Iowa Sports Team presents a special broadcast, the March to San Antonio. It's happening Wednesday night at 7 right here on CBS 3.